once upon a time, in ancient India, there lived a wise sage named Yogi. He was known throughout the land for his great wisdom and ability to solve any problem that came his way. One day, a young boy named Rahul came to him seeking guidance. Yogi, I have heard of a secret code called 369 that holds the key to unlocking the mysteries of the universe. Can you tell me more about it? asked Rahul. Yogi smiled and said, Ah, the secret code 369. It is said to be one of the most profound and powerful codes in the universe, but it is not easy to understand. Let me tell you a story that will help you grasp its meaning. Long ago, there was a great king who ruled over a vast kingdom. He was wise and just, and his people loved him dearly. One day, he received a message from a wise man who claimed to possess the secret code 369. The king was intrigued and summoned the wise man to his court. The wise man appeared before the king and explained the secret code. He said, everything in the universe is made up of energy, and this energy vibrates at different frequencies. The secret code 369 is the key to understanding these frequencies. Every number in the universe can be reduced to a single digit by adding up its digits repeatedly until you get a single digit. For example, 1234 can be reduced to 1234. Pin 10 can be reduced to 1234. 1. Now, if you take any number and add 3, 6, or 9 to it, the resulting number will always reduce to a multiple of 3, 6, or 9, for example. If you add 3 to 7, you get 10, which reduces to 1. If you add 6 to 7, you get 13, which reduces to 4. And if you add 9 to 7, you get 16, which reduces to 7. This is the secret code 369, and it holds the key to understanding the frequencies of the universe. Mm. The king was impressed by the wise man's explanation and asked him to demonstrate the power of the secret code. The wise man asked the king to think of a number between 1 and 100, and he would use this secret code to determine the number. The king thought of the number 74, and... The wise man said, add 9 to it. The resulting number was 83, which reduces to 2. The wise man then said, add 6 to it. The resulting number was 89 which reduces to 8. Finally, he said, add 3 to it. The resulting number was 92, which reduces to 2. Your number was 74, said the wise man. The king was amazed and declared the wise man to be a true master of the secret code. From that day on, the secret code 369 was known throughout the kingdom, and many wise men and women studied its mysteries. Yogi finished the story and looked at Rahul. Do you understand the meaning of the secret code 369 now? He asked. Rahul nodded thoughtfully. Yes, I think I do. The code is a way of understanding the energy frequencies of the universe, and it can be used to unlock many mysteries. Indeed, said Yogi. The secret code 369 holds many unknown secrets of the universe. But to truly understand its power, you must learn to use it wisely and with great care. As Rahul left the sage's presence, he felt a newfound sense of wonder and curiosity. He was determined to learn more about the secret code 369 and unlock the unknown secrets of the universe. Days turned into weeks, and weeks turned into months as Rahul immersed himself in the study of the secret code. He read countless books and spoke to many wise men and women who had studied the code for years. Slowly but surely, he began to understand its power and its potential. One day, as Rahul was walking through the forest, he came across an old man sitting under a tree. The old man appeared to be lost in thought, and Rahul was hesitant to disturb him. But something about the man's aura made him curious, and he decided to approach him. Excuse me, sir, said Rahul. 
I couldn't help but notice you sitting here. Is everything okay? The old man looked up and smiled at Rahul. Yes, my son, everything is fine. I was just lost in thought. Rahul sat down next to the old man and they began to talk. As they spoke, Rahul shared his newfound knowledge of the secret code 369 and the old man listened intently. My boy, you have learned well, said the old man. But the secret code is not just a tool to unlock the mysteries of the universe. It is also a way to unlock the mysteries of the self. Rahul was intrigued. What do you mean? He asked. The code is a reminder that everything in the universe is connected. Every action you take, every thought you have, has a ripple effect that can be felt throughout the cosmos. If you learn to use the secret code wisely and with great care, you can not only unlock the unknown secrets of the universe, but also the unknown secrets of your own heart. Rahul sat in silence, pondering the old man's words. He realized that the secret code was not just a means to an end, but a way of life. He vowed to use the code with great care and respect, and to always keep its true meaning in his heart. Years passed, and Rahul became known throughout the land as a wise and compassionate man. He used the secret code to heal the sick, to solve complex problems, and to bring peace to troubled souls. And through it all, he never forgot the old man's words, that the secret code was a way to unlock the mysteries of the self as well as the universe. In the end, Rahul knew that the secret code 369 was not just a mystery to be solved, but a journey to be lived, and he was grateful for every moment of that journey, for every mystery that was unlocked, and for every unknown secret that was revealed. The moral of the story is that knowledge and understanding can lead to great power, but it is important to use that power with care and respect. The secret code 369 may hold the key to unlocking the mysteries of the universe, but it is also a reminder that everything in the universe is connected and that our actions have consequences that reach far beyond ourselves. Ultimately, the true value of the secret code lies not in what it can do for us, but in what it can teach us about ourselves and our place in the world.